Mikhail, hello. Hi. Hello to you. How are you today? I'm fine. And you? I'm fine too. Uh, how, uh, how can you hear me? Is the sound good or not? Mm, I hear you well. Okay, great, great. Because I thought that something was wrong with my microphone. Okay, um, so I hope that other students will join our lesson. Mm -hmm. Because today we will learn some interesting idioms and uh, which are uh, which are consisted of uh, the colorful words. Yes. Yeah, so uh, do you know what does it mean? Like the idiom. Maybe idiom? You know some English it's like uh, uh, something like a sentence uh, which we uh, use. Uh, Ну, на русском это устойчивое выражение, вот на, на английском как-то. Yes, это? like said expression. Yes, said expression. Uh, Vitaly and Evgeny, hello to you. Hello. hello. Hi, Vitaly. Okay, so, Vitaly, maybe you know what uh, idiom is. <coughs> so, what is it? Idioms, it's, uh, it's something uh, very hard to understand uh, for us, it's uh, uh, when uh, when Americans or English uh, use uh, use these idioms, it's uh, it's uh, it's some phrases uh, and that for us it's make uh, easier, but we don't understand. We don't understand. Okay, so but every every nation, yes, so every language has uh, these uh, idioms, yes. Yeah? So can you give me maybe some examples in Russian of idiom? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. You may say it. You may say like it is more uh, like a proverb. Yes, it is more like a proverb or saying. Okay, so. But in general, yes, we may say that idioms are some set expressions, yes, which uh, are translated not directly, yes, in not uh, not in a direct meaning, but in the figurative. Да, вот как такое вот переносное значение всех этих фраз. Yes, and they are consisted of colorful words. Да, такие ярко окрашенные слова, то есть с переносным значением, да, с финальной окраской. Okay, Andrei, hello to you. Hello. Hello to you. Hello, how are you today? How are you? <laughs> are you are you great? Are you fine? Yeah, are you well? просто, очень плохо, плохо слышу. Плохо? Uh, okay. А uh, сейчас? Вы просто у себя громко чуть по, просто на компьютере, где вот настройки. Да, да, может ты погромче. Там ага, есть, ага, все там есть типа, микшер, когда нажимаешь, он там все, все громкости, там Google Hangouts надо повыше поднять. Ага, ну я с ноутбука, потому что мне это на большом компьютере нет камер с микрофоном. Ага, ну окей. То есть, я не знаю, но если хотите, все равно там около часов можете поднять громкость. Я поднял, сейчас уже лучше, да. Угу. Вот вас я слышу хорошо, вот а ну это прерывисто, то есть то нет вот звук. А она сейчас отпустит руку от микрофона и будет окей. Нет, нет, я его не то. А сейчас лучше? Сейчас лучше? Ну да, сейчас уже лучше. Is it better? Okay, okay, but I'm trying not to do it anyhow. Okay, so uh, now I will give you the link to the file with uh, the list of the idioms, yes, which we will learn uh, today. So we are about 15 of the idioms, yes. I hope that we will have enough time to learn all of them, to look through all of these. Yes, and just to discuss a bit uh, on this on the meaning of all these idioms. Yes, not just to learn them, but to discuss and try to understand their meaning and to uh, remember uh, such way. Okay, uh, can you see the link to the file? Yes, Hi, yes. Can you yes, see it? Yes. Okay, so will you open it and let us start? Yes. Um, okay. Uh, Andrei, did you open the file? No. No, you did not. What's wrong? Can you see it? I, I cannot find it. You can't? 
Uh, you can look this what uh, in the chat, yes. So it is in the right, in the right column of our screen. That is правой стороне. Правой стороне чата у вас. Правой стороне чата. Так, ага, вот что-то есть ссылка. Да, вот это она. Idioms dot docs. Is it your first time at this lesson? Yes. Uh, yes. <laughs> okay. First time here. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. So, just, uh, after some time, you you will get used to it. Okay. So, uh, did you open it Sunday now? Yes, I have opened. Uh -huh. Okay. So you can see the idioms. Yes, all the idioms. Yes. Uh, uh -huh. Yes, I see. Okay. Let us start with Vitali, I guess. Uh, Vitali, can you read the first idiom? Yes, so the English variant and the Russian one and the example to this idiom. Okay, can you read? Uh, a bad patch. Mm -hmm. uh, some mm -hmm. uh, He went uh, through a very bad patch last year. He lost his job and uh, his, his wife left him for another man. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes, so here you can see, yes? So mm -hmm. our idiom and how it is used in the sentence. So here you can also uh, see the uh, verb which we use with this idiom. Да? То есть bad patch, полоса невезения. То есть обычно, да, вот в английском, в русском мы говорим просто у меня была полоса невезения, да? I had a bad patch. В английском здесь вот больше употребляется такой глагол, как go through. Да, что-то переживать, проходить, да, какой-то вот тяжелый период в жизни. Go through a very bad patch, да? Go through a very bad patch. Okay, so uh, Vitali, can you just explain me uh, with the simple words? So to describe me the meaning of this uh, idiom in English. So what does it mean? What does it mean for you, a bad patch? It's uh, hmm? uh, it's uh, uh, sometimes when you have. Uh, bad uh, things every time, so it's, uh, mm, I, I don't know, it's for example, uh, you hurt your leg, uh, you, um, you lose your job or, or something like this. So. Mm -hmm. And all so. these things happen like at once, yes? yes right yes. after the other, like right after the other, each other, yes? One thing mm -hmm. happens after the other one, like a line of bad things, yes, of some unlucky things which happen to us. Yes, good for you, good for you. Um, uh, Andre, can you tell mm -hmm. me, uh, have you ever gone, have you ever gone through a bad patch? Can you remember such period of time when you uh, went through a bad patch in your life? So you had some bad moments, like some situations, some unhappy, I don't know, things which which happened to you. Yes, I I mm -hmm. had uh, I had gone through. Uh, yes, very bad. Mm -hmm. you may through say you may use I went through. Да, то есть I went through. Ну, я вообще вас спросила в present perfect, да, то есть было ли у вас когда-то это, да? Поэтому, это у нас просто было очень давно, что это... Давно. Да, ну, я в общем спросила, да, mm -hmm. когда мы спрашиваем о результате, I have went, да, I have, ой, went, I'm sorry, I have gone through, I have gone through, там, uh, a I... bad patch. Okay. Mm -hmm. I went through a very bad patch mm -hmm. in 2008. Ah. No, okay, yes, when you okay. use the definite time, it is better to use past simple. Yes, okay. So what happened to you? What bad things happened to you? Mm. The big cr crisis in our country began in that year and I lost my job and uh, I had uh, some other problems. Mm -hmm. Some other problems. Okay. Except for losing your job. Mm -hmm. So how uh, did you cope with it? How did you cope with it? Не понял. Cope. Да, cope – это у нас справляться с чем-то. How did you cope with it? What did you do? Можете написать, как это произносится? Yes, yes, I'm writing, I'm typing right now. 
what did you do? You tried to stay calm, you tried to solve your problems, and uh, what way did you try to solve your problems? Maybe you were searching for another job you are looking for. What, what did you do? Andy? I found new job. Mm -hmm. I tried some jobs. Mm -hmm. And uh, the time passed. I I have found. Uh, I cannot I cannot say that it uh, is good job, but um, that job when I have found. Which you have found, yes. Which which, which I have found. Mm -hmm. um, it was normal for me. Mm -hmm. In that period of time. That and now you are still working. You are still having that job, or you now now you are having another another job. We are still I, working. I here. have another job, but it is mm, it is the same that uh, mm -hmm. I have found I have the same duties. That time. Same duties, the same responsibilities. Yes. So, what is your job? Can you tell me? <laughs> Just to know you better. I work. I work. Uh, project engineer, and mm -hmm. an engineer. Uh huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay. Good for you. Good for you. Okay, guys. Uh, Vitali, maybe you will tell me uh, what should a person do uh, when he goes through a bad patch. So I mean, how. Uh, uh, sh how uh, should he uh, cope with it? Yes, what he should mm. do? Can you tell me? Uh, uh, I think uh, this man uh, had to think about his life and mm -hmm. uh, some something change uh, right now. Uh, mm -hmm. Because uh, uh, I think uh, when you have really bad situation and every time uh, uh, something happens with you, so uh, you maybe you you uh, do something wrong, and mm -hmm. you must uh, change, think, and uh, uh, <clears throat> and maybe uh, uh, be more. Uh, Kind, or I don't know, for people. Kinder, yes, kinder, kinder. Mm -hmm. to, to people. Uh huh. Okay. I don't know. I, I don't know uh, if uh, if something uh, about, uh, bad with this job, uh, and you don't like this job, uh, mm -hmm. so uh, why don't uh, uh, change this? Mm -hmm. or, yes. Or, so you find or, another, another one. Yes. Yes. Or another situation. So mm -hmm. you can you can f uh, f find. Uh, uh, the way every time, if you want it. So you should find some solutions, yes, to make it right. So to make your life right, to make it better, yes. So maybe to reconsider, yes, reconsider, like a bit smarter, but of своей жизни, да, maybe some values or something like some things which you you are doing every day, yes. Reconsider, reconsider your lifestyle, you may say, да. Пересмотреть свой стиль жизни. Okay. Good for you. Mikhail, what can you tell me? Have you ever uh, gone through a bad patch? And what was it like? No, I never been, uh, had been in a uh, bad patch. Had never gone? Da? Had never gone? Had had never never? Mm -hmm. In a bad patch? Just a bad. Da? Gone through bad patch. Go, ah, go through. through. Именно пройти, как бы, да? Да, как проходить, переживать. Gone through bad patch. Uh, and uh, mm, I think it's... Uh, uh, it's uh, uh, it's a hard question to <laughs> to answer it for me. <laughs> why not? <laughs> why is it hard? Why why is it so? Because so, I never did, been, uh, you been. Mm -hmm. So you you may say that uh, a luck is always on your side. Yes. Yeah? So you are a lucky person, and you never have some miseries or some bad things which happen to you. Yeah. I think uh, all, all, all bad uh, page uh, <laughs> uh, people can't uh, translate uh, <laughs> into 
uh, into good patch. <laughs> ah, good patch, okay. <laughs> как хорошая белая полоса. Ну да, в принципе, у нас же есть черная полоса и белая полоса, да, такая yeah. вот. Ну, здесь как bad patch, да, полоса невезения. Yes, we, I think that it is also possible in English so to use it. Yes, good patch and bad patch, yes. So, like two variants, two opposite meanings of this idiom, yes? Mm -hmm. it. Uh -huh, positive and negative. Okay, great. Good for you guys. Okay, um, let us move like one by one. Uh, Mikhail, will you read the next the next idiom and also the example to this idiom? Uh, a bed of roses, yes? Mm -hmm. Yes. Райская жизнь, не жизнь, а малина. Так, бин, а что это такое, бин зе там или... Yes, the, ага, the mayor. In the mayor of a small town is a bed of roses compared with being mayor of New York. What does it mean? How do you think? So it is like an interesting example with this idiom. What does it mean? So what is uh, like what what's the sense of this sentence? Так, ну получается тут быть мэром типа маленького города это yes. Тут как бы не непонятно как сказать даже если мы в таком это ну типа лучше или как? Лучше, да, is a better process. Это райская жизнь в сравнении с а, uh, ну, правлением, можно сказать, да, правлением, правлением Нью-Йорка. So how do you, how do you think? Is it right? Is it what what is like the sense of sentence? Are you agree? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. Do you agree with it or not? <laughs> I think it's partly. Uh, I partly agree partly. <laughs> it, what? It's huh? Частично? Ага, 50-50, like you may say. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, maybe uh, be, be um, mayor of uh, big uh, city is uh, more in interesting. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's interesting, but it also demands more what? Требует mm чего? -hmm. Андрей, maybe you will tell me. I have uh, some difficult. Some yes, uh huh. Difficult. What what uh, is it difficult for you or what? I cannot say anything about it. Ah, you cannot say. Mm -hmm. Maybe my. А как сказать настоящая вот сейчасшняя жизнь? Nowadays, nowadays. May, maybe my nowadays life. Um, is a bit no. of uh, I, I think. Okay. Nowadays, uh, моя жизнь на сегодняшний момент, тогда если жизнь, да, мы говорим current, my current life, current days of my life. Да, current uh -huh. на текущий момент. А nowadays это вообще в наши дни, да, nowadays или на сегодняшний момент, <coughs> уже тогда без life, да. Okay. А, а ну, напишите, пожалуйста. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm writing, I'm typing. Да, текущий, настоящий момент. My current life, да, то есть current, current у нас uh, прилагательное, поэтому с ним мы используем uh, существительное. А nowadays, да, это уже просто такое выражение в наши дни, на настоящий период времени. Mm -hmm. okay. Я просто прилагательное не могу вот на слух. Mm -hmm. Видимо, все-таки связь вносит свои какие-то коррективы. Мне нужно... А, current days. Current, yes, current, yes, текущий, yes. да? Okay, so what what did you mean? What did you mean? I didn't get it. Can you can you explain one more time? Oh. What did I mean? Mm -hmm. So your current life, your current days. So what it was difficult for you? So you said something like that. I can to take uh, I can take a very big vacations for me, and now I don't work. Mm. And now I live and don't work. I make big repair in my flat. <laughs> okay. I do what I want till so, September, ah. till September of this year. Mm -hmm. So you can say that now uh, your life like a bed of roses. Yes. I, so I think this? yes. Uh, <laughs> oh, compared in my past life. 
uh, what can, can you repeat please <laughs> compare in my po past ah, life ah compared uh -huh. comparing to your past life yes so uh, nowadays yes uh, it is like a bed of roses uh, if uh, like yes compared to your past life yes comparing yes, yes. compared Yes, comparing, that comparing to your past life. That's comparing sort of in, in. Comparing, yes, comparing, comparing with your past life. Yeah. Okay, yes. okay, good for you, Vitali. Uh, what about you? Uh, how uh, can you describe what does it mean for you a better process? So what, uh, what this life is like, a better process? Um. I think uh, people who uh, who has a bed of roses life like a bed of roses uh, they are very happy because it's uh, it's really good when you feel every day and every second very good. It's uh, 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 being uh, uh, happy uh, uh, and uh, understand. Uh, what you need to do in this uh, in your life it's very hard because uh, uh, if you do uh, or, or for example you do your job and you don't like it it's not uh, you don't uh, enjoy it so I think uh, uh, you you uh, do no mm, it's like a bad page, maybe, mm -hmm. because, uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> because um, you're not happy about this work, and you will never, uh, you will never uh, grow uh, with your job, with your job, because you don't like. You it, won't so. have any like the career growth, yes. Yes, yes. I think. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, only happy with, da uh, happy with, what happy with about? Oh, happy with. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Vitali. Okay, let us move further. Uh, Evgeny, are you with us? Or not? <laughs> okay. Yes, I'm, I'm with you. Okay, okay, uh, it's great. Can you read the next, uh, the next uh, idiom, the third one? Yeah, one minute. Uh, the next idiom is uh, blind date. Uh, no, no, uh, before, before it, a big fish, yeah? A big fish, большая шишка, важная птица, he works in Ministry of Defense, and I think he's quite a big fish. A big fish means uh, a, a human that is uh, important uh, to... Is, mm -hmm, someone in, who is uh, occupying some... Uh, higher position maybe than you, and you call him a big, big fish. Mm -hmm. Yes. This, this way. Who has maybe big influence, yes? Yeah, maybe, yeah. On maybe, maybe, that's right. Maybe who has uh, big, uh, no, uh, bo possess something, yes, maybe. Who had, I don't know, yes, a big influence. That would be a big influence somebody's lives so like that okay do you uh, have uh, like big fish among uh, among your friends maybe among your surroundings uh, I have, have uh, big fish fishes right no fish uh, in singular and in plural has the same form that fish riba uh, fish ribby which the noise also aha okay uh, um, Итак, о чем я говорил? Я mm -hmm. several uh, big yes, fish. So, uh -huh. Yes, I had have, have several big fish uh, <laughs> among my friends. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, this is. Okay. Do you have uh, like uh, are they good people? Can you yeah, they uh, are describe them people. as good people? Like uh, they are personalities, personalities. So don't, uh, aren't they maybe a bit arrogant? Um, no, they they are just usual people without any. Uh, I cannot tell anything bad about them. They are just good to talk to and so on. Because they uh, can <laughs> see this lesson. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They can uh, see this lesson. <laughs> yeah, because okay, yeah. Evgeny. So it is like the next question to you. Uh, do you think uh, like do you consider yourself to be a big fish? 
Uh, what? Do you consider yourself to be a big fish? No, no, I'm not. I'm not no. uh, a big fish. Uh, no, at the In moment, no. World. <laughs> okay. Uh, do you want to become maybe a bit later? Maybe a little fish. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Uh -huh. It is like the expression also is uh, appropriate here, like a big fish in a little pond. Да, большая рыба в маленьком пруду. То есть когда да, то есть человек имеет влияние какое-то, может небольшое, да, в определенном месте, да, небольшое, но зато хорошее хорошее влияние. Okay, what about you, Andrei? What can you tell me? What do you think of such people, big fish, have you met uh, them and what do you think, what kind of personality are they? I have no big fish of my friends, but um, maybe, maybe I know other people. They are policemen, for example, in our country, in Policeman. my city. Uh -huh. Police. Policemen. Uh, mm. Yes, we have certain. I, I, I don't know. I don't know personality. I don't know personality. Mm -hmm. Okay, no, just just in general, maybe just in general. So what these people are usually? Yes, so when they have a big influence. Yes, when they are so important. Yes, to other people, and they are like uh, considered to be important. Yes, among other people. So uh, maybe they also have. Uh, some certain features of character, yes, which they can, um, like, not maybe have it uh, all the time, but they acquired this feature when they became so important, yes, like, acquired, not really, to is, черты характера, like, arrogance, maybe, yes, self, uh, to be, like, being self-involved, да, вот self-involved, ну, вот, когда человек очень сильно себя любит, ценит, да, вот, self Bold uh, or arrogant, arrogant, да, вот высокомерный. Don't you think that such people can be arrogant sometimes and self-involved? Uh, can you write? Can you write? Yes, it? yes, I will write. Vitaly, what about you? Mm. Can you repeat the question, please? Uh, don't you think that uh, people, yes, big fish, so. Uh, who we can call big fish, mm -hmm. they can be arrogant sometimes or self-involved, да? Yeah? Arrogant, self-involved, высокомерные, да? Высокомерные, слишком вот тебя любят, ценят. I wanted to say about it. Uh, yes, I think uh, they are uh, arrogant uh, because um, I don't know. Um, um, the difference uh, between uh, a big fish is is uh, is a good person or bad uh, bad person because if they are friend your friend and they really want to help you uh, if you want some help help so uh, it's uh, without money without just uh, just really want to, to do it so it's it's good when it's for money and uh, he is just your uh, not friend, знакомый, как будет? А, знакомый. Извини, так, да? Правильно, acquaintance, это знакомый. Yes, you may say acquaintance. Acquaintance, so it's like, uh, and you really want, uh, and you really need help, and uh, just for money, I think it's, uh, it's a big fish, but uh, these people are very bad. I don't like uh, this type of people because uh, because uh, every time uh, these people uh, uh, use uh, uh, her, uh, their um, uh -huh. power. Strength, power, power, yes, the power. So it's my my opinion. Oh, yes. So, uh, have you met such people, by the way? Have you met them? Uh, yes, I have uh, one uh, one person, but uh, it's my friend, and uh, he he helped me. 
just just help me because uh, it's really friend friendship. And I have, and I, of course, I have uh, people. I know people who uh, who who is really big fish, but uh, if I need help, I never uh, go to them. So you you will not go in to ask help. Yes, to ask help them. Yes, of course. Okay. Okay. Okay, thank you for your opinion. I see another student, Anastasia. Hello to you. Hello, can you hear me? Hello, yes, I can hear you well, very well. Okay, so now I will send you the link uh, to the file. So, with our idioms, yes? So, we have uh, looked through several of them. Mm -hmm. okay. And now we will continue learning this. Okay. Can you open it? Yes, I opened it. Okay, thank you. Okay, maybe you will read the next one. The next one, it is uh, still on the first page. Uh, after a big fish. Да, вот мы big fish только что проговорили. Blind date. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, can you read the uh, translation and the uh, example to this? Uh, with yes, this yes. Video? I saw the meaning of this phrase. So uh, there is there was interesting story about a blind mm -hmm. okay because I am a journalist and I should uh, write article about a blind date. Mm. So I uh, visited one in yeah. Kiev mm -hmm. uh, and it was very interesting. <laughs> so it was like an experiment. <laughs> To write it, it, for me, yes, for me it uh -huh. was a, a big experience, but uh, um, I have to say that it's very, very interesting because uh, it's special event. I, I mean that I was written about special event where people come to have a blind date. Mm -hmm. uh, so uh, there was uh, there were some uh, guys and some uh, girls and uh, they seated uh, near each other and uh, had only 15 minutes to speak like uh, how how can we call like it like speed dating yes uh -huh. yeah speed date yes, yes. maybe it's right. not a blind date yes but okay but yes i'm listening to you uh, so it, it was very interesting because uh, uh, you don't have opportunity to see more than you can see during this uh, speed dating because mm -hmm. when you communicated with uh, person you can uh, see and feel everything. I mean, uh, you accept the person m much better, but uh, it is enough. <laughs> to speak with uh, somebody during 15 minutes to understand that you don't want or you want uh -huh. to continue yes. your <laughs> chatting or your friendship. Uh -huh. Okay, <laughs> yes, so it is enough to understand whether you want to to uh, see him or her again or not, yes? <laughs> yes, yes. yes. Well. You, uh, uh, it is interesting because sometimes people can say that, oh, you have to know some person deeply and more to be a friend, but I think that uh, it's enough. And uh, uh, 15 minutes, it's enough to understand you want to continue or no. And there is some interesting uh, info from scientists. Uh, they say that uh, peop I think that women during some seconds <laughs> understand <laughs> they wanted to continue uh, um, some conversation with uh, men or no and uh -huh. I tested it I can say that it's true <laughs> it's true <laughs> yes okay okay so uh, what about you so have you met someone there uh, uh, would, someone uh, would interesting you know? What about? Uh, I didn't uh, understand the question. Ah, so have you met? Uh, like, what about you? Have you met someone there who was uh, rather rather interesting to your mind? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, but I had some very funny experience in my life about blind date. So I. Um, 
I chatted uh, with uh, one guy in Big Mir, and mm -hmm. then we decided to meet uh, meet each other, and there was a very very uh, small photo mm -hmm. in his uh, profile. profile. Yeah. Yes, but the uh, chatting and uh, communication was very interesting. And uh, once I decided that I had uh, free time and wanted to see him, and it was terrible situation. <laughs> <laughs> because when I saw him, <laughs> my mood was absolutely down. <laughs> well, <laughs> and, uh, I didn't know what to do because it wasn't polite to go home. <laughs> but in the same right, right. time, it was nice for me to <laughs> to spend time with this guy, and it was the 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 worst. <laughs> The I worst date you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The worst blind date. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, after I decided that it's not my way <laughs> to, to go for a blind date. Uh -huh. So now you you are afraid of going to such dates, yes? Uh, no, I I never will go. <laughs> you will never go. Okay, but uh, okay. Uh, thank you, thank you, Anastasia, for such an interesting and funny story. Uh, guys, what about you? What do you think of blind dates? Have you ever uh, been to such dates? Have you ever had such dates, blind dates? Vitaly, what about you? Uh, yes, I um, have had this experience, but uh, <laughs> um, I... Um, uh, before uh, before the uh, meeting, of course, I uh, tried to uh, to uh, lear learn this uh, this lady uh, more, and of course, I need more photos. Uh, and uh, uh, yes, and so uh, important for everybody. We need, we have uh, we have uh, now we have a Skype we can uh, use and see each other. So. Uh, it it uh, doesn't was uh, it didn't uh, was uh, dis disappear. Uh, no, uh -huh. it, uh, disappointment. Disappointment. it was a disappointment. It was a disappointment because um, it it wasn't a uh, surprise for me. So uh, I I I saw uh, that I uh, achieved all that. What what? I didn't expect. Expect, yes. So you yes. liked it, yes? It worked out, так как сработало, получилось, so everything was great. Yes, yes, uh, yes. It was, it, it, was, uh, it was when I, I was 16, uh, it's uh, when uh, the uh, internet uh, just uh, begins, so uh, uh, every people want to chatting and uh, we have a lot of uh, uh, m meetings uh, and uh, it's not uh, only uh, well, it, it, it's uh, not only was uh, um, uh, like date yes uh, it, it was friends a uh, friend friendship uh, a lot of friendship made so it was uh, very interesting okay 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 thank you Andre what can you tell me about the blind leads so how do you think I have never gone and I have never gone. I have n I have never you may see I have I never uh been I have, never, blind. I have never been in a bl blind date. Do you want to try maybe sometime? Mm, I I did not try because when I have a plan to to go to meet to go to meeting, uh -huh. I, have, I have any information about people. Uh huh. So you don't want to go to a blind date because you don't know a person so good, yes, so well. So to meet him, you are afraid. Yes, I, I, yes? yes I, I can see photos, I can see profiles, and uh, if, mm, if I cannot see it, 
I I will not go. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, yes, yes, maybe you're right. So uh, nowadays, uh, appearance is rather important. Yes, so people are attached uh, to all the photos, especially nowadays when some websites, uh, some uh, out social networks, yes, are important. People always uh, they are trying to find their love. <laughs> The, uh, maybe maybe I, I came new job. What? Maybe what? I came new job. Now, can you repeat? I didn't understand. Yeah. Mm. When I came in new job. Oh. What happened? Может быть что-то я неправильно сказал? Нет, ну что, попробуешь, когда начнешь, когда будешь работать на новой работе, правильно? Сейчас. Окей. Окей, let us maybe move to another idiom. So, uh, when I came in a job. <laughs> it, it may be a blind date. Uh, <laughs> blind date with your <laughs> boss or what? <laughs> what do you mean by with, with, with the dating. <laughs> <laughs> with my future colleagues. Ah, future colleagues. <laughs> okay. Okay, but it is a bit another sense. Yes, blind date blind date, it's more like when you uh you are going for uh a date, yes, with the woman. Yes, men go with the woman uh, and vice versa, yes. So Okay, to to have some love love uh, relationship, yes. Okay, uh, so another yes, another idiom. Who will be the next read? Maybe Vitali, yes. So the last one was Cecilia and Vitali. Can you read the next uh, idiom? A born of intention, coming with convenience. Uh, we for we. Um, Worked for uh, so long that we forget that the bone of uh, contention is. We forgot. Yes, what the bone? Forgot. Yes. Okay. So, what does it mean? What do, can you explain it in English? A bone of contention. Um, what does does it mean? It's uh, mean. Uh, I don't know how 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 it's explained. Uh, maybe when you have some deal and uh, and and uh, with maybe some with, uh, some corporation or a company and uh, you have uh, a man or another another corporation who don't want that you make this deal, yes. And uh, it's every time make something bad that uh, your deal uh, didn't uh, accept, uh, make design. Okay, okay, I, I understood your point, but uh, let just to explain it maybe uh, in a more like simpler way, yes, so it is the reason, the reason of uh, some fight, yes, so some quarrel. So when people uh, have a fight, yes, have a fight. Uh, so the reason is the reason of this fight. The uh, fight is the bone of contention. Yes. Okay. Anastasia, yes. uh, can you uh, tell me? Can you maybe remember your last fight with someone, and what was the bone of contention? Oh, for now, it is politic. <laughs> Aha. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> okay. So the, uh, now it is very popular for people to argue and to have a bla uh, a bone of contention uh, about uh, different views uh, represented on TV mm -hmm. about yeah. Russia and Ukraine. 
So I have uh, some friends abroad, and uh, for example, uh, one friend is living in Bulgar uh, Bulgaria. Yeah, Bulgaria, uh huh. Bulgaria, yes. And uh, often, uh, usually, they have news uh, from Russia. And uh, when we speak about some uh, news uh, and events in Ukraine, he all time trying to <laughs> how to say to uh, uh, that you are wrong. That you are wrong. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yes. 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 Uh -huh. To okay. say that. Uh, he tried to represent me Russian views, and it's our bone of contention <laughs> all time <laughs> okay, yes. because I'm living here, and uh, as I understand from my friends who are journalists and from some views uh, and news I am reading uh, and seeing, uh, it is very very different views. Yes, yeah, different. Yes. Uh, and it was, I think, the last <laughs> thing that. Uh, but it is funny that uh, once I said that we had to stop it because it will be the end <laughs> of our. Yes, of so your friendship. Yes. Okay. Uh, yes, and it is funny because uh, he didn't live in uh, Russia. And he lived in another country, and he uh, absolutely. Uh, sure uh, that his uh, views is right. Mm -hmm. Are right. Because so he watched uh, some uh, views or some not views, some views which uh, Russian channels yes show. Yes, he has presented, <laughs> and he didn't believe me because he is like zombie. <laughs> no, yes. <laughs> <laughs> with all this, yes. So we can say that nowadays, yes. So due to our uh, problems in political world, yes. So with all this stuff, uh, so we can say that media, yes, media is uh, the main bone of uh, uh, contention. contention. Yes, so it is the main bone of contention because they uh, show uh, us uh, different channels, Russian, uh, either Ukrainian. They show different points of view, different views. Yes, different uh, things. Yes. And that's why people don't know what to think of it and don't know uh, who they what should the truth. Yes, mm -hmm. and what they should believe in. Yes, and what is the truth. So, so we lost the truth because of media. Yes, it is. Yes, the and because of, uh, that because of media that uh, not uh, that didn't show but create. Uh, yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, so in fact, so that's why it's a big, uh, huge propaganda mm -hmm. on TV yeah. and in media, and it's a very big bone of contention between people and between nations. I think it's not bone of contention; it's war. <laughs> no. <laughs> Um, it's war, but it's it causes, uh, it causes the war. Yes, we may say like it causes informational uh, war. Yes, yes, informational war. Yes. So, like here, we can say that it's a bone of contention. Yes, to use our idiom, mm -hmm. so it is appropriate also. Okay, now the student has joined us. I said, uh, <laughs> "Am I right to spell your name or not?" Hello. Hello, how are you today? Um, uh, you don't uh, you don't understand or what? Okay, I will give you maybe you if you don't want to speak or don't uh, know enough maybe English enough, I will give you the link to the file. Maybe you will just listen to us, okay? То есть я вам скинула ссылочку на файл, да, если что-то непонятно, вы открываете просто файл, мы здесь изучаем идиомы, да, наши. Открывайте и следите пока, да, следите за тем, что мы говорим. Непонятно. Окей, окей, so now just listen to us. Окей, 
Uh, so another, yes, another is uh, who is the next to read? Mikhail, will you read the next idiom? Oh, the next, the next idiom, it's a uh, brainwave, yes? Mm -hmm. Brainwave, the such idea. Uh, oh. While in the Babas, uh, Archimedes, uh, Archimedes. Archimedes, Archimedes, <laughs> okay. Archimedes had a brainwave uh, for uh, calculating uh, the, vol uh, the volume of uh, irregular sh shaped solids. Yes, yes, one, да. So this story, yes, about Archimedes and his uh, genius idea. Okay, so just uh, maybe example uh, example is not very good. It is rather difficult with all these terms. But here we should uh, see the verb which is used with this idiom. Yes, have like have a brain wave. Да, когда ну вот осенять, да, то есть в нашем понимании мы это говорим меня осенило. I had a brain wave, you may say. It. Да, вот это блестящая идея. Это и будет меня осенило. Окей. Okay. Напишите, пожалуйста. What? Uh, okay, okay, I will write. Uh, what a brain wave? What should I write? The idiom. Когда, когда осенило, вот сама фраза. А, окей. Okay, uh, Mikhail, can you tell me, uh, can you think of some moments in your life when you had brain wave, waves? So just remember some, <laughs> some uh, moments. I try to, uh, to have a, uh, <laughs> a brain wave in a bus too. <laughs> <laughs> in a bus too, <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're trying to follow the arguments, yes, example. It's a, it's a very, uh, how is it, a famous uh, method uh, to, to, uh -huh, yes. uh, to, to uh, if you uh, try to have a, a new ideas or a brainwave, <laughs> you're going to a bus. In the title okay. it's very interesting too. What? In the, in the title it's very interesting too and famous. Uh -huh. Think about it. Silent, silent. Silent, silent yes. Ah, okay. <laughs> I think in, in a bus it's more uh, productive. <laughs> productive, effective, yes, effective way, okay. But so it's expensive. <laughs> what? But it's expensive. Every time but water is uh, go down. <laughs> <laughs> but you still need to wash, yes? You still need yes. to wash yourself, so... <laughs> I don't think that too expensive. Okay, uh, can you think of uh, the last uh, brave wave you had? Yes, brave wave, I'm sorry. Can you think of? So what was it about? It's a question for me? Yes, yes, still for you. It's a secret. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's about my work. <laughs> ah, your work. So you had a brave wave uh, related to your work, yes? Some a yeah. good idea how to uh, maybe to, to invent something in your work yes mm -hmm. what was it about yeah, so yeah. okay did it uh, did it work out when you tried it when you tried to use your brain wave <laughs> work out это работать да когда вышло получаться work out что-то получается да it was a good idea for work so it worked out yes so this was Okay. Okay. Uh, Anastasia, what about you? Uh, I am sitting and thinking <laughs> about it uh -huh. <laughs> and can't remember <laughs> what okay. was the brain wave. I I, I can say that uh, the the hugest brain wave was uh, during my seminar in holotropic breeze. So there is some way to uh, to, to solve uh, to, uh, your problems or some. Uh, it's very long story about this method. Uh, there is there is not there is but uh, th there was a couple who created this method. Growth. It is a method of relaxation or what? I, I no, no, it, it's uh, quite a big work with your breathing. 
Ah, uh -huh. during uh, different kinds of music, oh. and uh, during it, uh, you uh, are trying to transform your uh, thoughts, or I don't know, I, I, I mm, how to explain it into words, but uh, it's very popular, and now uh, it's quite hard method. It's like uh, some psycho psychologist, uh, Psycho uh -huh. psychologist, psychological, uh -huh. okay, method. Yes, it's a kind of meditation. Yes, you mean? Uh, yes, yeah, yes, but it's quite harder. So you can see different, uh, I don't know, colors uh, or some ideas or uh, to remember something that. Uh, that uh, it's quite uh, uh, painful was quite painful for you, and then you solve this problem. And during this uh, experience, it was very, very big <laughs> brain waves in my head. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Ah, so you had like <laughs> a storm, yeah. yes, like a storm of brain. Yeah, brain. like a brainstorm. <laughs> uh -huh, brainstorm. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. And okay. I had a lot of uh, big ideas, and one of them uh, was to create a cartoon festival, and it was some. Uh, after this seminar, some people uh, feel more creative energy, and uh, if you feel something like this, you have to continue and to uh, produce something that you wanted. And after this seminar, I decided to organize a cartoon festival for children, and it was a brainwave. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So did it work out? This festival? Yes. Yes. Uh, I I'm not sure that it will be this year, but last year it was very nice. There oh, was many uh, <laughs> children who sent uh, their works to our festival, and then we showed to them these cartoons created by uh, children. Children. Oh, mm -hmm. it's so, like a new movement. Like. Something, something new. I've never heard of it before. Okay, a great, great brainwave. <laughs> yes. Okay. okay. Thank you. Thank you, Anastasia. So uh, let us may learn uh, the last one, mm, the last idiom. Yes, which is uh, right after brainwave. Uh, whose turn is that? Uh, Andri, will you will you read? Yes, right after brainwave, <coughs> the last one. So. We are running out of time. I need a thing. Hmm. I think uh, the best of brainwave <laughs> in my life was uh, by my bicycle. <laughs> <laughs> I bought my bicycle in April of this year, and now I don't almost use uh, buses, trolley buses. And uh -huh, so you uh -huh, are riding your bicycle. I go on it very often. Mm -hmm. In the city, sometimes uh, out of my city. Mm -hmm. It was very good brainware in my life. Maybe, <laughs> maybe, so maybe the best. decide to buy a bicycle, yes? So the decision of buying a bicycle, it was your brainwave, yes? Yes. Am I right? Okay, okay. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. So, um, okay, so uh, unfortunately our time has run out. Okay, uh, thank you. Thank you all for this uh, lesson. Maybe the rest of the idioms you will learn uh, by yourself. Maybe it will be your homework if it is, it, it is interesting for you. So you may read the rest of the idioms, yes, by yourself. So the idioms, the meanings, and the examples of these idioms. Okay, thank you all, uh, all of you. Uh, I was thank glad you. to see you all, to meet new people at my uh, at my lesson. Uh, I hope to see you again at my next lesson. It will be 
uh, next uh, Wednesday. Uh, we will be talking, it is, uh, it is also will be a lesson of speaking, yes, to train our speaking, any grammar. Uh, so we will be talking about our goals and plans for our, on our, uh, of our life, yes, so some plans which we are thinking of and which we are trying to realize. So next lesson we will be talking on this topic, okay? Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you too, thank you too, have thank a nice evening. Mm -hmm. oh. Thank you. Oh. Goodbye. 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 Thank you. Goodbye.